All right, everybody. So what's up? Welcome to this live. We're going to do some water changes on this little uh, two-gallon tank. So we're just going to wait a little bit for, uh, what do you call it, for everybody in the live chat to start popping up and start coming on. And like I said, make sure you subscribe and click the notification button to, so you can catch other future lives and shit. But it's going to be a hardcore podcast, like I said, not podcast, a uh, hardcore episode. And like I said, make sure you tag along, tag along and I said, we're just going to wait a little bit. Yeah, that's me going on the other, on my other phone so I can read you guys' comments. Uh, but yeah, man, make sure you guys join. Uh, put a thumbs up, all that shit. But yeah, that's what we're going to do today. And maybe before we start, I might do the, the salt water first. What do you guys think? Should I do a should I mix the salt first or should I do a water change? Because I still got some salt water from the other video that's going over. I'm thinking about doing that or using that. Uh, let me know. Let me show you guys a close up. Hey, I'm driving. Oh, hold on. Melanie. Oh, snap. Melanie Simpson. Hey, I'm driving, but I'm listening. Happy Friday. Oh, thank you, Melanie. It's nice seeing you. <laughs> Sorry, I'm looking at Mo's comment. Um, but yeah, happy Friday to everybody. It's a really nice day. And like I said, we're going to do a little water change. This is going to be a an episode mostly dedicated to this uh, little two-gallon tank because it doesn't get enough love, even though it's my favorite tank. Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> Mo, <laughs> hey Mo, and thank you for joining, man. You're a real supporter of the channel, man. It means a lot, bro. And everybody that's on there, man, thank you guys for putting that thumbs up. Cause I got four people in the chat. I mean, and four thumbs up. That's a uh, almost a hundred percent success rate right there. But yeah, I want to show you guys a quick look before I start moving. Well, I hit the coral. I mean, I hit the desk, so some of the pops went in, but. Oh, yeah, another thing, I should clean the glass, so I just want to start off with a little bit of a glass cleaning. I might, like I said, I might do the salt water first. Howdy, y'all. Ha, <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm thinking about what to do first. I think we're going to mix the salt first. Uh, well, actually, let me clean the glass first so you guys can see in there, and then we're going to start uh, mixing the water. Grab a little. Yeah. All right, so first we're going to start off just by cleaning the glass as best as we can because I know I have a lot of snails on there. And like I said, I have, a, I have seven Australia snails in a two-gallon tank, which is overkill. But because of all the, because the lights been, like, the lights, I have a 12-hour, wait, no, 10 at 10.30. So I got 12 hours and a half of a, of a light cycle. But, um, yeah, I'm going to clean the glass first and then clean the floor. Okay, so anyways, when you have a long light cycle like me, you're going to have a lot of algae problems, so I end up having a big cleanup crew for my tank. So that's why there's uh, seven Australia snails, which on a two-gallon, if you ask anybody, that's kind of a lot. All right. See, so yeah, I got I to remove all the salt creek first before I try scraping the glass. And also, uh, if you get a small thing like this, make sure you get a, a glass aquarium. This is an acrylic one. But if I would have known about the glass ones, I would have probably got a glass tank instead. <laughs> but I saw this at the store, so I was like, oh, man, that looks like a cool little tank. I'll buy it. Was it Marine Ranch or something like that? They make a really cool uh, glass aquarium. A little two or three gallons, something like that. I think it's three gallons. Definitely check that tank out. All right, so we're going to clean the glass. And then I know we're going to be... God damn it, who's calm? Huh. 
<laughs> Damn. All right, anyway, let's, let's keep going. So yeah, I'm going to try to clean the glass as best as I can. Get rid of some of the algae. I, I put the towel on there so it could uh, slide a lot better. Oh, damn. I see a lot of little snails I don't want to mess up, but I'm just going to clean the front. Sorry, man. Sorry, little coral. All right, good enough. I mean, I still see some algae on there, but the snails are right in the way. So, <laughs> I'm going to show you the steps. <laughs> uh, all right, so, once you get your glass clean, assuming you have your salt water ready, so let's. I have some salt water uh, ready, but like I said, we're just going to mix them up together. And then I'm a, and then I'm gonna show you everything else that I do in this little tank. But like I said, this little tank is easy maintenance. It's not that hard. So it's like I was like giving the top down view. So sad. Look at that little guy right there. That's my favorite coral in here. I think it's starting to grow on that rock. You see that on the back. I said I'm thinking about clipping this little section right there and putting it on the other tank, but <laughs> not until I get rid of the algae on that side and the other tank. What the heck? Oh, there you go. You see the little oily stuff on the surface? We're going to try to get rid of that. Yeah. Anyways. So what's I going to do? I'm gonna go get the fresh water first, guys. Damn, I forgot to get it. go get it. Hold on. Sorry, guys, I forgot to clean my bucket. All right, so we're going to mix the salt. And like I said, you guys probably seen me doing it before. But um, let's get that done. All right. Let me get these cords out of the way. All right, bam, right there. You see that? Brenda, what's up? Hey, Brenda. Thank you so much. Oh, yeah, that's another thing I was going to do. I was going to order the scale today. I'll probably order it online with you guys. Uh, but anyways, uh, yeah, I got I to gotta get that scale today. And like I said, uh, when I get the scale, thanks to Brenda, we're going to mix some salt together. I actually make salt water like the chemist way, like how, how you're in a fucking lab. We got no access to the ocean. We're going to make some fucking real salt water like from scratch, scratch. You know what I mean? Just minus the calculations, guy. Did that shit for you. All right. So when it pour in the salt, like I said, um, get yourself the salt. Um, <laughs> this is the same bag I've been having on, but yeah, this is got the fucking salt. Um, like I said, I usually put them in a white bag, but I'm using.
Alright, you guys, that's another thing I do recommend. Make sure you have your, well, I recommend to have your salt water, I mean your salt water. Yeah, your saltwater tank on your Alexa. Hook it up to Alexa. That shit will help you out. Make sure you get some smart plugs. And, man, it works pretty good. Oh, another thing on that little, uh, on this tank. I shortened the light cycle to eight hours, so we'll see how that happens. So we'll see what's up. Brenda, what up? Let's say Mo. Don't do that, man. So giving away your secrets. Oh, okay, man. No, nah, Mo. For, for uh, I'm not gonna. <laughs> I'm not gonna sh tell you guys what I'm mixing, and at the same time, I might confuse you guys a little bit for sure. But uh, if you don't think I should, then I won't. SMO East Los in the casa. Henry, what's up, bro? Hey, Fernie, thank you for joining, Fernie. <laughs> um, how was work, bro? I hope your work was pretty good today. Went smooth. I said, Fernie, West Side. <laughs> Hi, Fernie with the sauce. Brenda, the co-host. Yep. I love Brenda. She's really cool. Like that. Hold on. Well, don't spill it out. Man. That's all I'm saying. Because of Brenda, I'm going to get that new scale. But like, I said, not to, not to show you guys how to mix stuff. But I probably won't. I probably won't. Damn, that's why I mix it with hand. You gotta mix it with some balls. It's supposed to be working right now. My beautiful. I <laughs> say <Stay> fucking pretty. <laughs> Yeah, bro, it's all good, man. Henry, you don't sleep, huh, Vato? Nah, man, always working, man. Um, today, I was supposed to go to this, like, reef show shit that I was going to do. What the hell is this from? Oh, wait, that's, that's from right here. Okay. Oh, wait, what the fuck is this little cab for? Uh, yeah, I was supposed to go to, like, this set up this reef show shit today. I didn't fucking go. <laughs> I fucking go. I was tired, man. I was gonna take that little tank with me, but then I'm like, eh, I'm not gonna go. Henry, do you take naps during the day? Uh, once in a while, I might pass out, but normally not really. Um, but um, I'm usually just active. La Flau, that's the homie vamps. <laughs> fucking a mo. <laughs> Left out, left out, Fernie. We were thinking the same thing. Yeah, nah, man. Um, I really don't really take that much naps or anything. Right. Once in a while, I do. If I wake up early, my body might go to sleep early. But like I said, um, I oh, fuck. I remember when I used to smoke and shit. I, I would smoke in the morning, and around twelve, like in the afternoon, I was still tired. I would have to smoke again, and then around like three, smoke again. I'm tired of all that shit, but I'm glad I don't fucking smoke anymore, man. Fucking, fucking feel great. Thank you. All right. When the, you're on a conference call. Not today, Fernie. Brenda, yes, I was. SMO 1916. That's uh, cheeky. Dracula for sure. <laughs> and he said he's active and he functions. <laughs> oh, Brenda, man. <laughs> Mo, how's the weather? Oh, man, right now the weather is fucking amazing outside. I know you're talking to Mo, but look, look at that. It's nice and sunny outside. Fucking beautiful. All right, anyways. 
I hope you guys are having a cool day. If you're in part of the world where it's not sunny and shit, well, you know, there's no such thing as a bad day, just inappropriate clothing or, fuck, man, might have a little attitude adjustment. But I do know sometimes when it's cloudy and shit, it could bring your, your energy down. And how old were you when you started smoking? Damn, Brenda. But honestly, I was 18. I was out of high school. I'm going into college when I started. But I don't really don't like talking about that. <laughs> I feel like I wasted some years of my life. Brenda, it's perfect over here. 79. Hell yeah. Nice and warm. 72 today. Computer, what's the temperature outside? Right now, it's 72. Computer. Shut up. Yeah, it's 72 also, Fernie. I just sat down. Little Dracula always catches me when I'm drinking coffee. <laughs> Damn, bro. You're always drinking coffee, bro. All right. Smoking damn coffees, man. I mean, drinking damn coffees. <laughs> Remember this is this particular batch of salt? I, I had somebody else trying to make it. I didn't supervise supervise them, but we're using their fucking mixture. Hopefully they fucking didn't fuck it up. Craving a caramel for sure. Yeah, the caramel coffees are pretty badass. Mo black coffee, right? I had a good Mexican mocha today. Hell yeah, Brenda. That sounds good right there. Hold on, guys. I'm fixing uh, my hair real quick. Henry are cooking some mess like Breaking Bad, loco. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, some saltwater mess and shit. High school. Shit, I started in the middle school. No, man. I started after high school. Not even in high school. But like I said, I'm not proud of that. Fucking, I don't know, man. I really don't recommend people to be on in anything, man. Um, I mean, it's cool, honestly. The honestly, if smoking wasn't bad for you, I'll still, I'll still, I'll still probably be doing that shit. But uh, uh, but ever since I stopped it, I actually feel better. I don't really crave it or anything. Um, I could be around people smoking, and I really don't give a shit. I don't get the temptations or anything. But I do know if I smoke that shit, I'll fucking start smoking again. I don't want to do that shit. <laughs> so it's like, fuck that. You know what I mean? Brenda Espresso is clean. Where do you get the next mocha? <laughs> In la panaderia, man. Brenda, is that what you always get? I heard not say when, what I've done. Shaking my head. Yeah, I feel brother. I'm probably not even gonna start saying that shit, but but I don't know, man. Everybody fucking that knows me knows. Like I said, I was one of those people that not even I thought I would ever stop. Right. Hey, but you know what? People that do do drugs and shit, I don't look down upon them and shit. I know it's hard to quit, and then sometimes you, we don't want to deal with a lot of the bullshit in life. And even if you're like a functioning addict, you're fucking smoking, but you're doing shit. But if you were to stop doing whatever it is you're doing, you'll do a lot more shit. But I noticed every time that I stopped, <laughs> my life started turning around. 
that's some serious shit. Go oh, at this little spot called Pepper Grind Coffee. Nah, I get you HCB. Not for everyone. Yeah, man. Uh, I was even told, man. Hey, um, nah, I'm not. I'm not gonna say that. Cause all people, I I know people that that drank beer and they stopped. They were like heavy drinkers. They're like, hey, Henry, you know what? Beer is like the what's bringing me down or brought me down. I know you smoking is gonna be bringing you down. Yeah. In a way, they were right. Breaking Bad is badass. <laughs> Henry, I'm a square. I never did nada. Hell yeah, Fernie. If you never did anything, bro, don't fucking start any of that shit. They say that smoking blood or anything doesn't have no health effects or anything like that. That's all bullshit. It's, uh, everything you do has a, a side effect of some sort. I mean, fucking even soda will give you fucking, uh, what do you call it, diabetes and shit. Fernie, I get brown sugar shaking express, so I made it myself. Now I perfected it. Hell yeah, Brendan. I like how you use brown sugar. If you use a white sugar, if I'm not mistaken, they put it through a chemical. It might even be bleach. They bleach it out. That's why it's white. Brenda, I refuse to believe it. <laughs> I've been clean one year off. Everything. Gracias a Dios. Yeah, Brenda. That's what I say to myself, you know, I gotta go fucking a year and more without fucking doing anything. But damn, I'm glad you did, brother. That's a big big ass accomplishment. Damn, that that's that's like a success story. To me, everybody that quit is a success story. Even uh you know what, Ese Benny, he's always in the community also in the chat. He told me he couldn't quit and then I started chatting up with him, and now he's telling me he's clean. For a, now it's been probably, what, like two months? I don't know how long he's been, been off, but that's a huge accomplishment from him, too. When there did you see El Camino, the movie? i never even seen that either. I don't know. How do you make it, Brenda? El Camino was all right. Hey, is it on YouTube? Is it free? <laughs> if it's not free, then I got to wait until somebody fucking puts it up. Before they take it down. Brenda, congrats, Mujer. Yeah. That, that's a big accomplishment, man. Not doing anything is a big accomplishment. Right now, <laughs> you know, I, I told people I know, you know what? My next drug is going to be fucking money. <laughs> I want to be craving that shit. I want to be getting urges to make money. <laughs> That's right. That's honestly what I said, and then and then they told me, "Well, hola que Dios te escuche." <laughs> I said that to some family members, but but yeah, man. Like I said I said money's gonna be my new drug. <laughs> Brenda, happy for you. You got a good heart, regardless. Yeah, Brenda's a good, good, uh, a good woman. I order the syrup, make a shot of espresso, and add the cinnamon and oat milk. Oat milk. Netflix, no? Yeah, I had more questions. They just... Well, I had more questions. They just wanted us to keep going back to see more. <laughs> yeah, for the sequel, huh? I haven't seen that movie. She'll be craving that already, HCB. <laughs> Turns out the money? Yeah, man, like, I need some money. Hey, but for real, guys, fucking... I used to even calculate the percentages I would spend on fucking smoking, dude. Fuck, right, man. I'm so ashamed of even admitting it. So, like, I know if you are if you have some kind of bad habit, <laughs> the chances of you having a lot of money is pretty low to me. From my experience and from what I see other people. All right, guys. So, I'm going to put this this uh, water back in the... Back in the Like I said, guys, I don't hide anything. I really don't give a fuck. I mean, it's whatever. Okay, that's some heavy shit. All right, so I'm going to grab it. I'm going to siphon it. Just trying to put it somewhere where you could actually see what I'm doing. All right, I'm just going to let it siphon, and then uh, I'm going to look at the tank because it's pretty boring looking at a fucking bucket.
All right, we're going to let it siphon, and then we're just going to look at the aquarium. There you go. Henry, stream it on your phone, on my Flixer. It's free. You can watch movies and shows. Is that is that what it's called, my Flixer? That's pretty badass, bro. I got to go check that shit out for sure. Nice Brenda, oat milk and almond for me. Can't do leche no more. Oh, are you lactose intolerant, bro? Mo 1916, when I feel like a gava, I get honey, oat milk, latte. <laughs> yes, Fernie, it's exact. Yes, Fernie, yes, exactly. Just for the views. Hey, Rainer, what's up, G? Thank you for joining, man. Yes. DX1, nasty crew checking in, sucking toes and eating booty like groceries. <laughs> Damn. DX1's on a roll. <laughs> no judgment. <laughs> no judgment. Yeah, guys, hold on. Let me get a top view. Hopefully, I can get the camera to stay. Oh, let me lower it down, though. Lower it down. If I could get this camera angle, that would be pretty badass. But I, I doubt it, though. Yeah, it's going to be pretty hard to get this camera angle. Yeah, I can't get it, guys. Fucking, I tried. I tried. I was trying to do a perfect sky view, but I can't do it. But damn, look at that. That's like I said, that's my favorite one right in this tank right there. It's no comparison. Look at that. And this tank's more mature than the other tank. That's why it does a lot better. DX1, what up, loco? Fernie, you fancy. That's right. Oh, wait, wait. <laughs> Fernie, you fancy. Hey, that's what I get for making fun of this hipsters. No more leche and cheese. <laughs> but just playing for me. Rainer, laugh aloud. Yes, Fernie is fancy for sure. HCB, you lectured your son yesterday. <laughs> I said, Mo, <laughs> my son. But yeah, man, I told him to. Uh, I told him not to, man. And I took the wrench off, so in case he goes on and he says something dumb, just to put him in timeout. But yeah, I told him about it. I bought above ground pond today. Oh shit, Rainer for reals? That's pretty cool. DX1, I need to request a refund. Javi didn't sing that song I paid for. <laughs> Hey, for real, it's Fernie. Oh, dude, talking about that shit, bro. Fuck, dude. Uh, I was watching that right now before I went live. I couldn't stop laughing, dude. Uh, when Love Machine was singing the, the Carrie Perry song, <laughs> I fucking died, dude, when he started. <laughs> Man, I, I, I couldn't stop laughing, dude. That was the best fucking... That was the best song uh, or the funniest song. I don't know what you want to call it, but of the night, man. Oh, uh, damn, that shit was the funniest. Uh, but yeah, man, check out Love Machine. When he sang the, what was that song called? I don't know. I know it's uh, Katy Perry. Whatever the fucking song name is, that shit was funny. DX1, Sup Cochino. <laughs> what up, friend dog? Mo, Brenda, Con Amor, Rainer. 
1916, when I drink it, I put in my pink, put my pink to loco. Oh, I'm not, I'm not too sure. I think I'm reading it wrong. Laugh loud, Fernie. Brenda, I ate fancy. I ain't fancy. Fernie, that's how I eat my tacos. <laughs> Chicky Dracula wasn't on Javi's live yesterday. I requested that one for Corey, last six, nine. What song? Hold on, I think I missed it. Hold on, I missed it. Yeah, you know what's crazy? Corey was the only one that sang all three songs in Spanish. HCB, Fern Dogs, Fern Dogs drink a latte with his pinky in the air. <laughs> you know what? When I drink hot shit, I put my pinky in the air so I don't, so I don't burn the pinky. <laughs> but it, it happens naturally, though. I need a glass house heater and large skimmer. Hell yeah, Rainer. Henry, you are cheeky. Drax. It's dead, Ferdy. They, uh, I, I was actually there. Uh, I caught the last two songs on the show. I just came here for HCB Read. <laughs> Fucking mo. You guys promised me Hooked on Phonics. <laughs> I'm still waiting for that shit. <laughs> Hooked on phonics, man. I remember that shit in the 90s and shit. <laughs> you got to get hooked on phonics. All right, guys. So let's fucking do that. Water change. <laughs> so you won't burn the pinky. No, nah, man, because when you grab something hot, I don't know why, but my, I just put the pinky up. It's like a natural reaction. Rainer, how big? DX. That just doesn't sound right, loco, what you mean, so you won't burn the pinky. <laughs> well, when you grab a mug, bro, it's, I don't know. I don't know, dude. It just happens naturally. I think that's why people say pinky up, because it's a natural reaction. I don't know. Sus. <laughs> 500, 5,000 liters. God damn. Look, guys, I, I'm just waiting for my the siphon tube or whatever. Hey, Raider, that's some pretty big ass shit. What's five thousand divided by three point seven eight? That's how many gallons you have. Let's say divided by four, five. That's pretty big. Anyone here eating capelutada today? Oh man, that shit's pretty bad. That shit's pretty badass. Pretty bomb. Now, nah, when you drink coffee with your pinky up, you are fancy as vato. <laughs> Fuck, I guess, man. Because I'm fancy, huh? Damn, little tank looking good. Oh, uh, thank you, Mo. Like I said, uh, I was going to try to do a sky view because it takes time for the polyps to open. But look at that. I keep I keep uh, messing with the stand. Every time I hit the stand, like I said, I want to hit it because I don't want them to close, but. Damn, these guys are spreading like crazy. Wildfire right there. That guy is too. Like I said, I just started with that little piece right in the center. It grew on the frag plug. Now it's starting to go on the rock. Uh, this guy was more open, but he saw me fucking with it when I was cleaning the glass. Same thing with that guy. It closed up. But damn, like I said, this is my favorite little tank. And if you look at the rocks, they were white. Well, you guys see my white rocks, right? Hold on. See, it's white as fuck. And then they get purple when you have a good light and then give it a little bit of time. But that's what happens. You get all the coralline algae. So all that purple shit, that's coralline algae right there. That's what people want. And then some people, they don't like getting uh, sea urchins because the sea urchins start eating that shit up too. Brenda always me, me saluda like three hours later. <laughs> DX1. <laughs> Uh, 
Hey, she's she's a busy woman, man. 1,320 gallons. God damn, bro. That's a big fucking pond. That's like a small little pool. Pinky up with the little cups. <laughs> DX1, I want I want to get some my jefita I used to make from scratch. Hell yeah. Mo 1916 East Los Style Vato. Henry, did you see the video of the secret coral farm in Thailand? Uh, let me check it out. I'll tell you. Did I just type that? Secret coral farm. Which one, bro? Oh, I talking about this one? Dude, I seen this guy do YouTubes. I mean, no offense, but all his tanks, they weren't really that good. He, he got pretty famous by traveling and talking about other people's aquariums and shit. We got to forward this bitch because I ain't, ain't going to be here all day. But if you're talking about this one, no, and I haven't, but I'm, I'm watching it with you guys. They're using natural sunlight. It looks that's what it looks like. <laughs> <laughs> fucking, they got all the brown ones. You see that shit? Ah, oh, fuck. They got all the brown ones. I got some green ones. I don't. I, I'm not really into the brown corals, but you know what I mean. Um, someone's got to get them. Oh man, that one's pretty cool right there. That green one. But no, nah, man, I haven't seen that one. I'm. I, well, I'm in, I saw it with you guys right now. But that 12 gallon dude or the two gallon dude, fucking. I haven't seen the tank that I'm impressed with that he actually did. It's always other people's tanks or aquariums, and he travels. That's why he got famous. I remember when he was in college, do, college doing videos. It's bomb as fuck, Fernie. Rainer, don't bring that metric versus, versus over here. <laughs> you mean the standard, Mo? The metric versus the standard system? Bullshit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. When we go in uh, in chemistry, uh, the metric system is a lot easier to solve. Shit. It looks like you mono is to commit suicide on the edge of a building. It looks like you mono is about to commit suicide on the edge of a building. Who? Yeah, that one. Oh, DX1. Oh, okay. I got it, bro. No, I haven't seen it, but I mean, I saw it right now. But that dude's got a quite a lot, large following, but like I said, all his tanks, they pretty much suck ass, though. Uh, no offense, dude, if you're watching this, 12-gallon uh, dude. Um, no offense, man. My bad, DX. I'm getting my hair done. I'm listening through my headphones. Oh, cool, Brenda. Thank you. See, Brenda's a true supporter. That's she, that's why she's a co-host. Hey, I was gonna ask you about that channel. His Colombia one was dope. The outdoor farm, nice land. Yeah, Mo. But yeah, man. The, uh, if you guys want me to do a video on all the saltwater people, maybe maybe even the freshwater people, but definitely the saltwater people that I kind of respect and shit, and, or I watch for different information. Um, let me know and I'll do that video. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> oh, you guys want to see some funny shit? Watch. Esperen, señorita. No se me desesperen. Uh, there's this guy named Reef Dork. That, that fool's fucking... <laughs> that fool knows I talk a lot of shit. But he's cool with it.
Uh, let's talk about the vibrant scandal. Watch. Fucking commercials. Oh, look, 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 look. Watch what he says. Watch what he says. Per usual. <laughs> See, that fool always talk a lot of shit. <laughs> That's hella funny, huh? Yes, they do. Get blue light. Yeah, for reals, man. The blue light makes everything look cool. He makes a nice choral show. Yeah, like I said, he makes a pretty cool show, but his personal tanks, they fucking... I don't know. I'm not impressed. But at least he has fucking something in there. It should be... You should do a karaoke in one late night, too. Damn, hell no. Well, I don't know, man. I'll think about it. But fuck, singing and dancing is like fucking the worst shit that I'm at. I can't do none of that. I can't do singing or dancing. I'm probably I'm probably better at judging just because I, I I like to say a lot of funny shit. <laughs> For any that would be fucking golden. Ah <laughs> damn the karaoke fuck. I can't I I can't memorize any song or anything. Brenda, what you fancy AirPods on getting your hair done? Brenda, oh watch out. <laughs> okay, cheeky drags we get. You crushing on Brendizel. Hey man, don't hate. It's mad love. You know, you know when they do that circle, that heart shit? It's mad love. <laughs> HCB, you should sing Goodbye Horses. Damn, which one's that? I never heard have I heard that song? Oh actually I'm not gonna play it because then fucking YouTube is gonna fucking delete my shit. I need some aquashella here. <laughs> HCB, tell him, you know, SMO 1916 from East Los Vato. <laughs> oh, Fernie. Well, dressed like a vampiro. Hell yeah, man. Fernie, Vato's Locos, DX1, I say he does, que no. Meche, <laughs> mamá, Mas putos. All right, anyways, let me do that water change, man. Make sure you guys see me do this shit. Like I said, if you have a small tank like this, fucking do a water change about once a month. I do it. I do it often just so I could uh, <laughs> promote my shit. <laughs> all right, guys. Uh, all right, so I'm uh, siphoning the sand out, try to get as much of that nasty shit from the bottom, and then fucking throw it back in. Damn, dude, I hate when I get water in my mouth. And like I said, people are gonna tell you don't gravel vac, but fuck that shit. Don't listen to those fools. Those fools don't know shit. <laughs> those fools don't know shit. Damn, we got that nasty shit coming out. Yeah, guys, I'm a firm believer in getting rid of all the nasty shit. Computer, turn off the water pump. That's enough. You see, see how much I did? Just a little bit. Uh, I try not to change more than 50% of the water. All right, guys, so I'm going to throw the water back in. And then we should be gold. Only actually, before I throw it in. Uh, 
Right, off camera, look at this. You see the salt, fucking, I mean, the salt, the sand. I'm gonna throw it back in. Good enough. Right now, throw that shit in. Normally, I throw it in the back, but fuck that. Oh shit. I'm just gonna throw it in. A la verga. Computer, turn on the water pump. Right, we're gonna let it run and then I'm gonna decide if I want to add some more salt water. But seriously, guys, if you guys could do that shit fucking once a month, maybe even twice a month, there's no fucking reason why you can't be fucking successful. Like keeping a little tank like that. Like I said, don't have any fucking fish in there, but you're good. Mo, love. <laughs> ha ha ha. DX1, yeah, I'm in love. ACB, you should do the heart sign at the beginning of the streams. <laughs> Fucking bo. <laughs> mo1916, I agree. <laughs> Fernie. Was that coral caca? Yeah, it's a little bit of a coral because they do take a shit, bro. Corals do take a shit. But a lot of it comes from the snails also. And then also I got these worms in here. They're called bristle bristle worms there's some bristle worms in here uh if i feed the tank i know they'll come out but there's little worms in there también but oh that's nasty shit oh and also the rock itself it produces a, a little bit of waste and shit um because of the life in it and then also some of it just comes out like uh kind of like sand or breaking the stone i don't know what the fuck but even if you just have rock by itself you have sediment of rock or Nasty shit in the bottom. A gravity vacuum has fins. <laughs> what? For reals, bro? Filter. I thought. Yeah, that was all nasty shit. Um, now we just gotta wait and see how the corals react. Oh, and also, I'm, at, I'm gonna show you guys what I throw in. So last thing, could you guys see that? Well, you can see it over there. Okay. So last thing, I'm going to get some salt water. All right. Then I'm going to throw a little bit of baking soda. Just a little bit because it's a small tank. Mix it up, mix it up, mix it up, mix it up. Like I said, the salt, uh, it already has uh, baking soda and hydroxides in there, but uh, since I don't really do change a lot of water, it, I honestly don't throw it in the in the front. I mean, where the corals are, I throw it in the back. All right, and then that's pretty much it. Only well, now I'm gonna fill up the tank real quick. Hold on, let me fill it up. I don't like having the, the tank all the way. I mean, I don't like seeing that line right there. But that's why this is my favorite tank, because it's so fucking simple. Oh, wait, damn, I forgot to add another thing. All right, guys, these are going to be two little popular products. Um, add some iodine. Shit, it's hard to see. There you go, iodine. There's different brands of iodine, so you want to make sure you add the one that's safe for the corals. And then add an essential element and amino acids. Um, just add a little bit of this shit. Oh, 
grab my pipette. All right, so here's a little pipette. I just grab a little bit, add a few drops. I added five, just for probably a little bit way too much for this little tank, but fuck it. And then on this one, I'm probably gonna add um, probably five drops also. I added seven, maybe eight. And that's it, guys, fucking that simple. And like I said, this shit, the iodine helps the inverts grow. And also the corals. Corals are also inverts, but if you have, like, hermit crabs, it, it makes them grow. Regular crabs, it makes them grow. Uh, what do you call it? Shrimp, camarones. It helps them grow. But fuck that. Damn, dude. Honestly, it's that simple. Look at this, guys. It's already opening up. See that guy right there? So we're going to give them a little bit of time. Just that they close up every time I move the lid. Like I said, fucking aquatic animals are sensitive to vibrations and shit like that. All right, let's catch up with comments, and then I'll give you guys another close-up. Let me get rid of this. It looks fucking like weird. Damn, it's that simple, guys. I don't know how else to tell you, but it's not that hard. Do you switch out the sand or not? No, Mo. Uh, the sand, I threw it. Well, I poured it inside that little cup, and then I just throw it back in. Uh, I don't really change the sand. I just throw the, the same sand. I just throw it back in because it's small tank. I don't really have that much sand. There's only like about maybe a half a cup of sand, maybe less. No more than a cup of sand in here. It's, it's the small amount of sand. I only throw the sand so algae doesn't grow in the bottom. I really don't need the sand in there, but. I mean, I could change it white and put the white sand in, but are you supposed to? Uh, normally, no, Mo, because if you change too much, you could start killing shit. But just stick with whatever sand's in there. And if you do what I did, I took it out. I throw it back in. But like I said, I, I swirl it in that little cup to get all that nasty shit out. I mean, I have some gobies. Hell yeah. Gobies fucking are the shit at moving sand. I used to use baking soda to cook. It works for fish, too. <laughs> yeah. That's the cooking one, I think. I'm in. Oh, shit. Hold on. Let me close my big-ass water real quick. Yeah, I don't know where the hell I bought this one, but, yeah, it says, for baking, cleaning, deodorizing. But yeah, this is the baking one. Make sure it doesn't have uh, any chemicals in there, other chemicals besides just baking soda. No fucking, uh, what's it called? Scents or anything like that? Aromatic scents or anything like that. As long as it says sodium bicarbonate, you're fucking good, 100%. You can't remove organic material with a vacuum. You don't have a, you don't have to replace the sand. Oh, yeah, no, but, I mean, uh, Rainer, I don't, <laughs> I can't fit my gravel vac in here. My gravel vac's too fucking small. I mean, too fucking big. Um, I can't put it in here. This tank is pretty small. It's not that big, guy. Rainer, oh, okay. Oh, you're talking to Mo. Okay, 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 I get you. Yeah, Mo, use the, when I do water change on my bigger tank, use, use that little gravel vac shit, but if, you have a little tank like this, 
I would buy a little uh, plastic straight tube. That way you could just, bam, go right in there. Because if you use that flexible shit, this part, <laughs> you're going to be knocking shit down. Unless if you want the sand to be white again. Yep. I always gravel back the sand so I get all that white shit back up and remove all the nasty dirt. Oh, Rainer, that's what I mean. So it doesn't matter the color of the sand. No, uh, no, it depends where you get the sand. If you get the one from the beach in in, uh, in California, you're gonna have a lot of iron and you might grow a lot of algae, but it doesn't really matter. But the white sand works better at buffering the water. This black sand is from uh, the volcanic sections. I think this is Hawaiian black. I think they got this sand in Hawaii next to the volcano. That's why it's black sand. You can also use black sand too. Yeah. There's also Fiji pink and the rest are just white. Oh, okay. Fernie, good for frying fish also. <laughs> Beer for the fish batter. Hell yeah. That sounds good right there. Mona is 16, okay. Got it, loco. Who knows who is watching or hearing? Yep, mm, shrimp. Tempura. Hell yeah. Oh yeah, guys, I, I can see the corals starting to come out. They're starting to... The polyps are starting to come out. It's hard to tell, but look at this guy on this side. See some of the polyps are out. Man. Fucking, like I said, it works that easy, that fucking simple. People that have a whole bunch of fucking mechanical shit, fucking, uh, what do you call that shit? Like calcium reactors, any kind of fucking reactor. You don't need none of that shit. I mean, this tank's fucking simple. And fuck, I, I have the same corals they have in their fucking tanks and shit. It's not that fucking hard. Then again, it's just the chemistry that matters. Um, followed by the lighting, then the water flow, and then your filtration, and then the feeding. Green sand has a lot of glass. <laughs> yeah. Um, that that shit's for reals. But this little, you fancy, huh? Do you bring you champagne while they cut your hair? Hell yeah. That'd be pretty cool, huh? <laughs> or at least some wine. Fernie, huh? Money thing, I used to, I use your cook a white substance. <laughs> no comment. Yeah, uh damn, I can't think of nothing white on top of my head, but I know what you guys are talking about. Fernie nah, she drinking a martini. Oh shit. That's some fancy shit right there. I'm getting you guys close up. I think that's the closest I could get. Wait, no, I need closer. Only that's too close. Bang. But like I said, guys, I really love this tank. Not like my other tank. This one doesn't give me fucking problems like the like the other one. Fernie, oh, you cook, not a consumer, laugh <laughs> out loud. No, no, martini here. <laughs> no martini here. Do a white light right quick so we can see from the outside HCB. Are you talking about, I could change the light color on my tank. Is that what you're talking about? Or the light outside? See, that's how the tank looks with white light. But... Where I run it is over here. Hold on. I have it marked so I could always go back. 
man right there. And then that's where I run it, and then with the white light outside. <laughs> Fucking dog, dude. Man, but the, the light kind of gives it... There you go. I might open it up a little bit. And just that it messes with the camera lens. That's why I, I usually try to close it up. Oh, yeah, those are my dogs right there. Fucking dogs are going that way. Brenda, how many olives in your martini? You gotta have two olives. Fernie, I thought you maybe got down on the pancakes, huh? <laughs> Brand on some pancakes. Which sea do you think I should do with my pond? Mediterranean Sea or Baltic Sea? I don't know, man. Uh, so you're doing a saltwater pond? That's, that'd be pretty badass, bro. My pancakes aren't fluffy enough. <laughs> Rainer, that is cool that you got that. Yeah, Rainer's got some solid shit. Brenda, baking soda makes them fluffy. Hey, for reals? <laughs> I really don't fucking know. It makes sense. It makes sense. 1916, yeah, we can say pancakes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're making pancakes, guys. Not the other white shit. All right. Yeah, for real. Hey, guys, sorry, guys. That's why, like I said, see my polyps? They're already coming out. So if they closed up over here because of the hermit crab. Oh, shit, I still have a hermit crab over here. That guy's supposed to be in the other tank. What the fuck? I missed the hermit crab. Damn. All right. So I, I guess there's one hermit crab in there. I was about to get him out right now, but I'm like, yeah, we're going to leave him in there. <laughs> Fucking hermit crab's supposed to be in the other tank cleaning the other corals, but fuck it. Thanks for the tip, Mo. Two olives. Yep. See, two olives. ACB, what is the best light color for a tank and sets the mood for the ladies? Hey, blue, bro. Go with blue. Go with a little bit of go with blue and a little bit of white. Kind of like this right here, bro. Or maybe even like oh shit. Like this tank over here. But preferably blue, because you wanna you wanna get that deep blue color. Kind of like if you're in the deep blue sea and shit. This 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 light might be a little bit too white. Uh, but this one over here, like I'm telling you, man, a blue, a blue, a blue color, cause it makes all the corals pop out, the co the colors pop out, and then fucking, you're with the ladies, bro. They love that shit. One hundred percent, they love that shit. The only thing he doesn't use baking soda. <laughs> That's what I thought, Ferdy man. For guy, I'm chatting with a bunch of sucios. <laughs> but the, oh, okay, I see. Any anyway, pro with that? <laughs> I hope you're talking about that, ladies. <laughs> I thought the red light district. Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, <laughs> the red light man. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> How come they don't call it the blue light <laughs> district? Do a rainbow and northern lights and clouds. Oh, yeah. Them northern lights, man. Not blue, Fernie. You're going to see all the previous stains. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> you got to clean up from the previous girl. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> Talking about martinis at that. 
of that movie with Beyonce and that psycho lady who gets the gut gets the guy a dirty oh it gets the guy a dirty martini i forgot the name good movie yeah no i don't tampoco no sé northern light nah really there's there's northern lights and there's southern lights in the hemispheres not just northern lights what what's what's the fucking proper name aurora borealis <laughs> i remember in fucking uh What's that fucking show called? The Big Bang Theory? They're, they're saying the Aurora Boring Alice. Mo ha ha. Mo ain't seen exactly <laughs> like a stain on yours. <laughs> Laugh out loud. Fuck, dude. <laughs> Fuck, man. <laughs> That's a funny shit. <laughs> Not blue. Hey, but don't worry on, on the blue lights. <laughs> I mean, the blue lights. Fuck. On the LED lights for actual fish tanks, you you don't need to worry about all those things. <laughs> no worries, man. Ah, oh, fuck, dude. <laughs> I used to want to move to Alaska. That was one of the reasons too. Yeah, dude, I've been wanting to go to Alaska. I don't know about permanently permanently living there, but fucking being there, fucking fishing some fucking salmon and all that shit. But, I don't know, man. It's out on. Reach the bears. It's not about what the ladies like. Exactly, Brenda. You got to do what you like and always assume that the girls... Honestly, women, they don't know what they like. You got to make them want it. <laughs> it's about what the fish is like you guys. <laughs> Hell yeah. See, Brenda's giving everybody game. Brenda, that's right. Tell them what, what to like. Yup. 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 A girl likes a guy that knows what he likes, man. But definitely go with the blue light, not a fucking white light, for sure. For your face tank. Because like I said, it, it's it's the closest color in the dark that's not bright as fuck, but you can still see. I'm <laughs> blushing. <laughs> like no me descubras way bam all right we're gonna leave that tank right there and then we're gonna go to the other one. Oh yeah dude um the fucking fish didn't die alaska a los catrinas ahí está The fish made it, so like I said, I'm going to start doing water changes on this tank with just the uh, tap water. Uh, but so far, so good. I do have the light on too much because you see all the black algae growing on the rims of the, the leaves. HCB. I finally know what SMH means, the shaking my head. <laughs> but anyways, fucking this tank looks pretty cool. Brenda, okay, I was just wondering because I wanted to get red lights for the for my future fish tank in my room. <laughs> hey, uh, Fernie with the sauce, uh, they have LED lights, and you can control the red spectrum also. They they have red on them, so you don't need to buy a different light. Just get the AI primes. There are other saltwater lights that have a uh, – because if you look at this light – damn it, I don't have my glasses on me. But this light is not just blue and white. It's a, it's a mixture of different colors. And if you buy the controller or if you buy controllers for your LED lights, they have red on them. You can just turn on nothing but the red. There's red, purple, blue, green, uh, yellow, and white. And then you have to adjust all the colors to grow your corals. But if you just have a lady over, just put the fucking red only. You don't need to buy a different light, bro. Uh, hit me up before you buy a light, and then I'll tell you which one to get. Now you can impress the ladies. Oh, babies. They ain't shit, but snow in Alaska. <laughs> Why the fuck would you want to go there? Just the wildlife, bro. Um, Gantina. Saita. There. No, not to the wild. The last frontier. Alcohol is illegal in certain parts of Alaska, actually. Oh, for real, bro? That's some bullshit. 
Fernie, since you probably know a few different ladies, you should get a light that changes into different colors. Just saying, that would that's what I had before. <laughs> like I said, buy that buy those LEDs, man. The the salt water ones, you can adjust all the colors. Also, you could also you could program it so different colors come out at certain times, so you can make it change colors also. Or just fucking tell Alexa to change the color. Um, color light bulb or some shit. But like I said, there's a special LED lights. Well, not special, but they're about fifty dollars more than this one, and I think they're two hundred bucks. And you could change all the colors, all the colors you want. DX one to hide from the government. <laughs> you don't know Aztecs live in the snow. <laughs> hey, they did, bro. They, they got him. I <laughs> mean, they got him. Like, I'm fucking sure. Somewhere. All right, guys. So I'm going to tell you guys about what the fuck's bothering me with this fucking tank. So this uh, CN enemy right here, <laughs> I was blasting it today with the water, with the air pump, with the air pump, with the water pump, with my skimmer pump. And now it's starting to move again. So hopefully this fucker moves because I'm getting tired of it being right there. I said, fuck it. You know what I mean? But, uh. Yeah, I was blasting it with water for like a good 10 minutes, and <laughs> now he's fucking moving, so hopefully he moves out of there. Otherwise, I'm going to force him out, because fuck, dude, I'm not getting any light. But that's why you see me trying to feed that motherfucker right there, even though it's kind of hard. But yeah, some of the things that's bothering me. Um, besides the algae also. I saw a perfect masculine looking tank at Walmart. It was round. Oh shit. Uh you looking for a circular tank, Brent Brenda? What's it called? The cylinder. But yeah, if you guys want like a certain tank, let me know and then um I'll put a link so you guys could get them. Moon phases are cool too on the light. Yep. <laughs> Rainer's like, yep. <laughs> Rainer's joining in with the ladies. <laughs> See, Rainer knows what's up. Just ask the ladies what's their favorite color is, then set the light. Yeah, see, Brenda's giving everybody game. Henry, you keep fucking with it. Let let it be and they'll thrive. Laugh out loud. Yeah, I get you, DX1. I should leave that enemy alone. <laughs> But seriously, man, it needs to move out of there. I don't know. I don't know if it's dividing, but it looks elongated. I don't know. Alexa ignores me sometimes. <laughs> Brenda. Yeah, honestly, sometimes I call her out and she's not responding. So sometimes I turn her off and back on. Wait, I was trying to see if I turned on the water pump. I forgot. Computer, turn on the water pump. Okay. Yeah, it was on. All right. Brenda, did he get that tank? Yeah, Brenda. Oh, especially Mo. Um, you need to get a tank, bro. F. Brenda with the love. I got a big one. A. Fernie, no, I like it for you. <laughs> yeah, Fernie, bro, get a little tank, bro. And like I said, um, I'll, I'll tell you which light to get. Oh, let me show you. Fuck that. I got, I got my phone in my pocket. All right. Let me show you the light I'm talking to you about. If you get a small tank. Let's go to fucking uh, Amazon. Uh, fuck Amazon. Uh, AI Prime. Fuck, man, they went up in price. A la verga, dude. What the fuck? 230 bucks? God damn, that's expensive as fuck. Well, anyways, they make this light also in a, in a white color version. 
But like I said, you see all the LED lights? They have different colors, and you just adjust it. There you go. You can just put on the red. So it has a uh, dark blue, uh, regular blue, light blue. Well, actually, that light blue is white. So it has dark blue. Um, I don't know what the fuck you want to call it. <laughs> Aqua blue? I don't know, but it has two different blues, a purple, a pink. A green, the red, and the whites. See that shit? Oh, look, it says right there. What the fuck? Fucking pendejo. Uh, cool white, blue, royal blue, photo red, green, violet, ultraviolet, and moonlight. There you go. Like I said, you, you adjust every single color. I, I usually don't promote this light to people that are new. Because they struggle to find out a good ratio and the colors, but oh look, here's the same one, but white. Oh, actually, don't get that one. That's a different light. But like I said, they make this in white also. Instead of being black, the black the black frame, they make it in a white. Two point one two pounds. Like I said, it's pretty well built, I guess. Color black. Like I said, they have it in white. Oh, there's the white. Akamolutioni. There, there, there's a white right there, if you like the white one. But like I said, uh, you can control all the colors that you want and just set it up for the mood for the ladies. And honestly, you don't have to go straight up red. You could go with like a... Was it red with a little bit of a violet? You know what I mean? Fucking... You can make unique colors. That's why this light's pretty cool, because you could customize all the light spectrum. On this one, it, they did it for you, but they did it in a way where fucking, if you're new, you just set it up to whatever color you want, and they put, they made the proportions so they can grow corals already. On this one, if you set proportions all fucked up, <laughs> you're going to get fucked up results. That's why I don't recommend it to new people, but if you're a little bit more experienced, uh, I would get this light, but... But if you want it for the ladies, definitely go with this light. Don't go with the one I got. See, I'm giving you guys fucking game. Masculine A trying to say about HCV. <laughs> hey, Mo, she's saying that I'm too buff. Yes, it's still under Henry. Came with everything. I like it for Fernie. Yeah, let's get that tank for Fernie. Hey, Fernie, let me show you a cool little tank, bro. Uh, what's it called? I forgot what it was called. Marineland, I think. What the fuck, dude? Marineland, three-gallon aquarium. There you go. Get that little fucking tank right here. This one. It's made out of glass. It's pretty small. It's only 60 bucks, but it comes with everything. Sorry, guys. This camera takes a while for the... This is a good-ass tank right here. Ah, what the fuck? You see that? Only this light doesn't grow coral, so... That's why I, um, I would change that light. But this one comes with the lid. It's elevated. You see that shit? The filtrations in the back. It's like the little one I got. But like I said, this little tank's pretty badass. If, if I knew about this tank before I bought the other tank, I would have got this one. And it's made out of glass, so you won't scratch it so easy. But that's what, that's what I would get. It's only 60 bucks at fucking Chewy.com. Oh, 54 in fucking Amazon. There it is. Marine Land Contour 3 Aquarium Kit. 54 bucks in Amazon. But you're still going to spend like fucking 200 bucks on the fucking light though. Uh, the one I got is 130 or 150 if you include the mount. Brenda, oh, okay, thanks. Mo, what is F.A.? Financial Association. I don't know what FA means. A cylinder tank looks cool too. Yeah, those cylinder tanks are pretty cool, pretty badass. 
Damn, so macho. I need a tank that is triangle. Just saying. Oh, they got the corner tanks, bro. Let me show you real quick. Come on, dude. Can't believe they're not showing it. Cause, man, because you have to be a reef ready. I don't think they make them all in ones. Or well, I think they just don't ship it because <laughs> of the fucking uh, dimensions, but they're. Corner tanks also. There it is. There's one right there. There's a whole bunch of corner tanks, but I'm just showing that they exist. But let me see one that's already set up. <laughs> the problem is I don't know how to spell corner right. <laughs> Fuck, fucking pendejo. Today I would like to introduce my new art. Damn, my phone's all fucked up. There you go. Uh, see the corner tank? You get a little corner tank. Maybe a smaller one than that one, but that's a corner tank right there. Damn, dude, this fucking phone. Well, anyways, there it is. I like Amazon. <laughs> yeah. Amazon has hella cheap shit. Brenda, I was checking that chat. It was I wasn't posting my comments. Had to close and reopen. Oh shit for reals, bro. Well at least it wasn't on F U. <laughs> Just don't use cylinders that are too high aquariums makes decorating difficult. Oh, yeah, Rainer, you have that tall-ass fucking cylinder freshwater tank, bro. i never seen a tank like that, bro. That's some crazy shit. It was close. Haha, uh -huh. I just pressed randomly. Henry, I'm from the hood. 230 for a light for fishes. I can't use a flashlight. <laughs> Local. <laughs> Uh man, hey, if you're not gonna illuminate the aquarium, there's uh these smart light bulbs. They change color, bro. All you do is download the app. Man, you can get any color. Watch, should I go get it? I got a whole bunch of them. Clown is waiting. Shark, <laughs> yo, yeah, they're waiting for me to feed them. I should probably feed them soon. Fernie, do you have a backlight? Brenda, no backlight. May I clamp desk lamp? And they let LED bulb. Nano cubes. Oh, hey, DX1, bro. Those nano cubes are pretty badass, bro. Damn. Dun -dum, dun -dum. <laughs> oh, I like that tank. Oh, yeah, man. There's a lot of cool ass tanks. Laughing my ass off. ACB, you're a geek financial association. <laughs> when I said FA. <laughs> FHA. Brenda, do they bring you a steak while you at the beauty salon? Hey, they should, man. That's some good service right there. <laughs> hey, Brenda, do you wear earphones? You can't hear the chinas talking smack. <laughs> uh, Uber Eats. Bo, the Vietnamese ladies are at the nail salon. Yeah, she's at the beauty place. I already don't know the difference, honestly, guys. Fernie, I'm not hungry. I drank my Mexican mocha and ate a McMuffin today. Oh, shit, that sounds good. 
Oh yeah, nails hair salon is a wet ass. <laughs> Damn, it's, it's funny how you guys know all this shit. <laughs> I would have I would never imagine. I thought it was an all in one. You go in, they do everything you want. <laughs> you know what's funny? Oh never mind. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I'm not gonna say it. Yeah, guys, fucking. Let me feed the fish real quick. I'm thinking about if I should feed the. What do you call it? The Bower Bankies or, or whatever, but. They look pretty cool right now. Everybody's been telling me I'm overfeeding. But like I said, the only thing I don't like is that an enemy in there. Otherwise, it would have just been a cool little tank. I mean, I wouldn't give a shit if anything else dies. But that little an enemy, man, I want to keep it alive for sure. Watch, if you guys look at it. I feel like I'll say it lame. <laughs> no, I was going to say, man, it's funny when some dudes fucking say. <laughs> for their, I don't know if they're joking around, but they're like, oh, I'm going to get a... Brazilian wax. <laughs> like, what the fuck? <laughs> you're gonna go to a fucking women's salon and you're a dude you're gonna ask for a Brazilian wax so they could wax your butt. I mean, your your weibos. That's just some funny shit. But, anyways, if you look at the. Yeah, see, that's why I don't like this anemone. But you see the anemone? Sorry, guys, I need to clean the glass. But if you look at the anemone, it's extending from one side to the other. See that shit? And I wanna get it out. Get the fuck out. But yeah, that's the only thing I don't like. Just that an enemy is fucking right there. You see the other half, I mean the other, the other side of it on the other side. But look, these guys are just waiting for me. Haha, <laughs> pinche clown. Pinche tiburón, everybody. Brenda, okay. I was just curious. Damn clown attacking the coral. <laughs> huh, for real, bro. Dun dum dun dum. What the fuck came back? Are you talking about waxing your waves? <laughs> Fucking DX one. <laughs> Rainer, she may split. Oh yeah, dude, it's probably splitting. I just I can't really see it though. Man, hold on, let me clean the Oh, I can't clean the glass right there because it's fucking snails right there. But uh I think it might be splitting, bro. Look at down the down the middle. Maybe that's why she's been fucking right there. I've been wanting her out. <laughs> like, get the fuck out. Oh, yeah, DX1 about waxing them bowls. <laughs> Go to a little Chinita place, bro, and tell them you want a Brazilian wax. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they'll move them around and go bam. <laughs> DX1, you missed the booty shave talk. <laughs> what the fuck? HCB, say it among friends. Never mind keeping that to yourself or me. <laughs> One man gets his Brazilian max. Mas puto. <laughs> no, I'm telling you, man. And I think they're just saying that so so the chinitas could look at, at their fucking uh at their chalone. Ah <laughs> 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 oh, fuck. Mo <laughs> covering the X one covering the ears. You guys make me say shit. No. Nah. But damn, guys, this guy, I thought it wasn't going to make it. So far, it looks solid right there. Fucking Millie right there looks cool. This guy is still struggling with fucking algae. See that shit? Certain algae. That guy's solid. Maybe the water flow is a little bit too strong, but fuck him. Hey, some, weird, some weirdos out there. Yeah, man, they're everywhere. Do you get happy ending? Bloom, bloom, yum, yum. <laughs> Exactly, HCB. <laughs> Fuck him. Uh, 
Like I said, guys, this tank, man, compared to the little one, this motherfucking tank gives me hella problems. Hell, I was looking at the fish. Hold on, let me feed the fish real quick. Damn, that's a lot of fucking food. Oh. Actually, I'm looking at this guy. He looks a little bit upset today. This guy right here. Maybe I should do a little water change right here. Keeps giving you problems because you keep fucking with it. <laughs> DX1, bro, that's so true, man. Honestly, you're just supposed to set the fucking coral and forget about it. So what you're saying is very true, man. What's bleeding mean? Oh, this, uh, the sea enemy, man. It looks like it might be splitting. I don't know what the fuck, but. You see how it's extending all the way to the back and then the front's right there? I think all retarded. But they normally fucking, uh, they hide it like that when they want to split, but I don't know, man. Like I said, it's just, uh, I want it to move. <laughs> you know what I mean? Dunham, dunham, dunham. <laughs> Fucking jaws, man. His Brazilian wax comment, you gotta make you talking about the same thing. <laughs> hey, bro, but is that what it's really called, bro? The Brazilian wax, bro? When women fucking wax down there or some shit? I always thought that was bullshit. I don't know what they call it, but that's why people have been telling me. Bernie, huh? Two weeks, fingers out, and feed less, and it will be different. Yeah, I'm hoping that, man. That's what I'm hoping, bro, for that enemy. Fernie, English, please. <laughs> Oh, yeah, guys, also, uh, Freaky Tail supposedly is supposed to come out. Oh, yeah, um, I started my light cycle to eight hours now, so it's supposed to come on. So it's, it turns on at 10, and it's supposed to come off at what, uh, at 6? I think I put 6.30, but I definitely reduced the light schedule on this thing. So we'll see how that shit goes. But I can't believe no other channels is coming out right now. That's some crazy shit. But yeah, man, other than the algae, man, this tank's pretty cool. Uh, and the anemone fucking upside down in there. I liked it when it was just right here out and open. What well, do you guys remember? That shit was cool. ACB hasn't talked about his bleaching yet. <laughs> You're talking about when people bleach their buffles? After Brazilian wax comment, you got to make sure you are talking about the same thing because they should be telling us his, gro his grooming secrets. <laughs> Ah, uh, fuck. <laughs> Rainer, Rainer's dead. That's what's laughing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Ah, oh, fuck. Like, there ain't no coming back from that. <laughs> That's some funny shit. Yeah, I'm thinking about doing a water change on this one, too. I think I might just end up doing it right now. Okay, we're going to change some water on this one, guys, and then we're going to call it quits. Just a little bit of water. And then we're going to call it quits. Uh, fuck it, let me put it right there. Well, before I change water, I might just feed the coral. No, fuck the coral. I don't say feed the corals, but uh, we, you see me do that shit too many times. You mean vampires are hairless, fool? <laughs> No water change, Rainer. I should leave it. No, I think I might change just a little bit. I don't know. Let me think about it. No drinking water. Oh, oh. Oh, I see. All right, let me, uh, I'm just going to set up real quick and then change that water out real quick. Guys, man, I really appreciate you guys being on here for, for real. Like I said, it was just a little bit of water. <laughs> Fucking snail. Man, this water feels a little bit cold. I'm going to check the temperature real quick.
Man, all right, guys, fucking perfect. Hope you guys can talk amongst yourselves and shit. Oh, fuck. All right, so like I said, that's my little water change. It was, like I said, it was a mini water change just to make sure if there's anything bad in there and try to get it out. And then I rinsed out that sponge, saw that little sponge, the little black one. So let's catch up on comments. Hello, left mass. HTV is supposedly working. So refer to me as Frank so they won't know it's me on YouTube. Laugh out loud. <laughs> All right, we'll call you Frank, Fernie. We'll call you Frank. The Henry, I think Mo is telling us he bleaches and his and is hairless. <laughs> DX1. <laughs> DX1, it's like the army in here. Loco, don't ask and don't tell. Oh, yeah, you work for uh, Boeing, huh? Was it Boeing, right? Or, or was it... Uh... Lockheed Martin, no Boeing. Yeah, Fernie, be careful, bro. My bad, bro. I'll, I'll call you Frank. <laughs> and I fucking just said it right now. My bad. <laughs> what are experiences with different substrates for saltwater aquariums? Uh, the the well, it depends what sand because I want to say sandy beaches from California, but I don't I don't I don't think you ever seen a sandy beach in California. Um. But sandy beaches in California are pretty cool to grow, like um, different macroalgaes or hair, uh, sea grasses and shit. Maybe not so much for the aquarium, but well, it depends what kind of aquarium you have. Uh, the black sand, people say, oh, hold on, before I talk about black sand, I'll go to the other tank. But the white sand, I think it works probably the best, the aragonite, because it buffers the aquarium. Because if your pH drops, the, the sand will start to dissolve and picking up the pH a little bit. Uh, hold on. Uh, I'll talk about the black sand right now. Stepped away. Henry burning the spot. <laughs> hey, DX1, don't say that, bro. Don't say that. Only on video. Oh, Rainer, well, it's, it's just, it's like a... I don't know. It has a lot of silicone in it, or silicon. I don't know what you want to call it. Um, it has a lot of... Damn, dude. I wish I had some fucking sand to show you. But uh, it has a whole bunch of different um, minerals in it. But a lot of it is uh, silicate or sil... I don't know what the fuck. Silicon. The same shit that they make algae... I mean, the algae wafers. The, the silicone wafers with, I think. I don't know, but it's just the, uh, it's like this brownish fucking sand, and it has a lot of iron in it. Fernie looking, the, oh sorry man, I forgot what I was supposed to call you. Oh Frank, the X one SHCB should just call my boss and tell him. <laughs> What's the number? I'll make sure you get a raise, bro. Silicate, yeah, there you go. Has a lot of silicate in that bitch. But like I said, uh, all that's good. Like all the the iron in in our sand is good to grow that kelp forest and shit. DX one at the ladies love it. Cut the cut the hedge so the trees stand out. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, that's some funny shit. It makes the joint look bigger, huh? Silicate. Yeah, see, DX one knows too. Silicone is for tank seals and boobs. <laughs> for real, bro. But yeah, I meant to say silicate and all that shit. Mode 1916, I only ship airplane parts. Yeah, dude, it's cause this, this dude works for the government. They say it's airplane parts, really, but it's for robot parts, man. Pretty soon they're going to take over the world and shit. Oh, hey, bro. Hey, have you guys seen my video on this robots in San Francisco? Hold on. Show you a quick video. It's a robot in San 
the fuck is it? Ah, uh, don't tell me I deleted that bitch. No, it can't be. Hold on. It's a car tire. Oh, that sucks. Don't tell me I deleted it. No. I know I have it in Instagram or whatever the fuck. Fuck it. But yeah, there was a man, I think I have it on the phone that I'm recording on. But it's a robot I saw in San Francisco and shit. But yeah, that was some crazy shit. If I find it, I'll I'll, I'll tell you guys right now. Fernie, nah, I'm looking because you said, don't ask, don't tell, like my ass saw. You know what it means, though, right? Airplane parts, aka drones. There you go. Fucking putting them drones. They're spying on us, man. No, because DX1 said you were telling us your little secrets. <laughs> And I know I put that fucking video on Instagram, though, about that fucking, uh, what do you call that shit? It's a robot. It, it looked more like the fucking robot from, what do you call that fucking, from Star Wars, only it was white. Like, talks amongst yourselves right now while I look for it. Damn, I can't believe I put so much bullshit in Instagram. Well, a whole bunch of fish shit. Oh, there, I found it. Look, there's a little robot. You see that shit? <laughs> My little promotional shit. But you see the robot? It's like a fucking bullet or something. <laughs> Damn, I, I, I can't believe I deleted the video on this phone. I, I don't think I was recording on this. Well, I think I was recording on this phone. But yeah, man, fucking robots in San Francisco. Bernie, oh, left my ass. Hey, get away. It's me, be the... <laughs> No drones, only anti-plane missiles. Holy fuck. If the hood needs to shoot down a ghetto bird, you got Cyrus. Look at my little fresh water tank. That's how it was before. You can see the plants in there. <laughs> and, then it, and then it is what it is right now. Oh, yeah, look at Santa Cruz, bro. Ah, oh, bitch. Oh, that's a little hermit crab I found. Anyway, just a bunch of stupid videos I made back then. Oh, look, this is me setting up a little freshwater setup. a long time ago. Well, not that long, but... I gotta turn off the music. Oh, yeah, Rainer, look, this is the sand that's similar to uh, fucking Santa Cruz. Or California, I mean.
I'm just gonna canister filter. Oh, that bullshit. Filling it up with the hose. <laughs> Anyways, fuck all that shit. DX1, I'm curious. Don't worry, it only hurts the first time. I forgot what I was talking about. ACB was scared to get out of the car. <laughs> ha! Huh. Hey, fuck that. I ain't going near that motherfucker. <laughs> fucking, fucking robot and shit. We need some new iron uh, dome system. A bit like river gravel. Yeah, it's a little bit kind of like river gravel, I guess you could say. It's fucking, uh, man, maybe next time I'll do a live in, in, in uh, Santa Cruz and shit. Yeah, dude, but I can't believe I deleted that fucking video. I was supposed to be... Maybe I'm just not looking at the right spot. Oh, yeah, if you guys never seen Redwood Trees, look at that shit. It's fucking tall as fuck. Redwood Forest, Sequoia Forest, but it's the little Redwood Tree right there. Fucking awesome trees and shit. I don't know if down south in, in Southern California you guys have redwood trees or you guys cut them all down, but fucking worth watching. All right, so we're going to go back to this little tank. And like I said, guys, we're pretty much done almost with the live. Look, I really wanted to show you guys right here. The, the focus was this tank, not the other tank. But look at this, guys. Uh, you see all the polyps are already open. That guy's out. Oh, there it is. There's a color. See that shit? This guy is fucking coming out again. Same thing with this guy. Hey, what was robot for though? Yeah, I don't know, bro. I don't know if it was cleaning the street or what the fuck, but I just saw the fucking robot at the gas station. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> I was like, fuck this. <laughs> fucking robots taking over the world and shit. But I, I, I just saw it at the gas station. I don't know what the fuck it was doing there. But it was in San Francisco, though. Damn, look at that. Boom. Tell you guys, fucking simple. I mean, there's a result right there. The fucking salt works. Um, a little bit of algae still, but fuck it. <laughs> fuck it. Hey, NorCal is beautiful and all red down here. Different environment. Oh, yeah, Mo, because I know uh, L.A. is a fucking desert, bro. Um, there's a lot of beautiful uh, desert plants and shit, but, yeah, I get you, bro. Hey, but for real, hold on. Hey, but um, I know redwoods could grow down there. I just don't know why they don't plant them down there. I'm not sure, man, but, man, the redwood forest, bro, you guys got to check it out. Even the sequoia forest, they're related to redwoods. They almost look like the same fucking tree. Oh, and a fun fact, the uh, redwood trees are fireproof. So I don't know why they don't fucking plant more redwood trees because they're fireproof. That's a, that's a fun fact that not even all these fucking dickheads on the news talk about. Because they don't want to talk about all the redwoods they fucking destroyed and shit. Because you hear about all the wildfire, what's called the wildfires in California, but nobody talks about planting fucking redwood trees, the native trees, so it doesn't fucking burn down. Fucking putos. ACB, are you doing another cheeky live Dracula live tonight to have my coffee ready? <laughs> hey, Fernie, do you work tomorrow? That's my question to you, because you probably quit the other the last night. <laughs> Hey, but uh, I might go. I might go on live tonight. Fuck it. I might tell you guys my my ghost story and shit. Freaking no! I was thinking if I go on tonight, it's gonna go after Freaky Tales. I thought it would been like a nice follow up. Tell you guys my little ghost story, but I'm not sure, man. Both saying no, so I don't know. Fernie's like, I gotta go on. <laughs> but let me know, man. Um. Because I was thinking if I go on, it's going to be after Freaky Tales. Does Amazon delivery drones really exist or only in the movies? Uh, so far, Rainer, I haven't seen that shit. I heard of robots, but I don't know about the drones. 
Hold on. Oh yeah. Get them HCB. Uh, 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 I forgot what we're talking about. <laughs> my bad, my my bad, my bad. Oh, I talking about Mo. Uh, I mean, uh, Fernie. No, I don't work tomorrow. Oh, yeah, I heard they build another reservoir though. Man, they need fucking. <laughs> For sure, they need reservoirs, but. Um, if they get, if California gave me fucking in charge of the water system in fucking California, fuck, dude, this fucking cunt, I mean, this, uh, this state would fucking look nice and green and shit fucking year round. But they fuck up with all the water, man. They put a lot of pollution in that bitch and then they fucking send it out to like either the sea or I don't know where the fuck, but a lot of the water in California, man, they don't know how to fucking manage it. Fucking water management, whoever fucking works there fucking sucks. But yeah, Fernie, I might try to go on uh, later tonight, maybe. But like I said, Fernie, uh, Saturday Night Lives. Um, I'm committed to Saturday Night Lives for sure. I'll try to do tonight if you want. After Freaky Tales, and if I'm not tired, I'm going to go on. Right now, I heard in that part of the Midwest, they use them. Domino's supposed to use one. Some of the Midwest. That might be true, man. I'm not sure. But I wouldn't be surprised if they started using drones, man. But if they start doing shit on drones, what they should do is fucking send, like, our fucking fish. You know, when we bag our fish and shit, they charge fucking, like, 50 to 80 bucks just to ship it to a different state. Overnight, so I think a drone would be a lot cheaper. It's a little bag, so I don't know. But damn, guys, look at this shit, man. Fuck, like I said, I love this little tank. It doesn't give me problems like that big one. But it's more mature, though. It should be whenever you can. Um, I was just asking. All right, for sure, Fernie. But like I said, uh, I'm committed to Saturday Night Lives, but... um. I'll try to go on later on tonight after uh, Freaky Tales. And then uh, I might tell you my ghost story. Like I said, I, some pretty cool shit. <laughs> some pretty cool shit. Well, it was more like some scary shit. Or I might just talk about a different topic. I don't know. It depends. I've been two hours and one minute in this live, so um, yeah, man, just start posting posting your last comments. I'm I'll probably be here for a few more minutes. They are currently testing them for deliveries. Not good though. They're getting rid of jobs, is what the agenda is. <laughs> yeah, anything that involves robotics, bro, or uh, machinery, for sure. I mean, they're getting rid of uh, jobs for delivery, but then. But then they're going to need jobs to manufacture the fucking drones. I don't know, man. It's kind of like back then people never thought uh, YouTubing or fucking podcasting and all this bullshit was going to be a thing. Or what's it called? Social influencers? Social media? Um, but for sure, man, it's ending a lot of jobs and hopefully new jobs will get uh, created. Like different types of jobs. Robot-driven big rigs in the works, too. No more middle class. Hey, uh, Mo, what they're also doing is that they're trying to do robots for uh, for crops, you know, in the fields, for, like, all the farmers and shit, the farm workers. Man, they're taking a lot of raza out on the fucking field, man. La Mano Peluda is now a ghost story. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, Fernie, but I got a real good fucking ghost story, man. Um, That's real shit. It's none of that fake shit, you know what I mean? <laughs> Fucking Mo. <no. laughs> if you have a hairy hand, it's because you whack it too much. <laughs> I remember that they used to say that shit, but that damn, that shit's old school, old school. That's like shit that they used to say in the 70s and 80s. <laughs> Fucking Mo. Fucking Mo, dude. All right, later, haters. <laughs> All right, guys. But, yeah, man, that's going to be the end of the show.
He said it was just supposed to be about this little tank and then yeah man uh, I might see you guys later on tonight it depends cause fucking sometimes Freaky Tales goes on hella late or fucking they cancel straight up but I'm hoping they don't but um yeah man um but like I said pretty soon I'll, I'll tell you guys my ghost story I was gonna save it if I ever went on like fucking dining with the wizard or some shit but I'm gonna tell you guys my ghost story it's some real shit though I want to have a faucet for seawater. <laughs> Fuck yeah, Rainer. I feel you on that. All right, fellas. Al rato. All right, guys. Yep, getting rid of jobs all around. It's coming, bro. Kitchen 2 robots that cook. Yo, yeah, bro. I heard about that shit, about the kitchen robots, man. They said, oh, they're going to replace every fucking uh, chef and shit. That robots could cook better than the chefs. Fucking they got all these fucking sensors and shit. Hey, but guys, uh, post down in the comments. Make sure you fucking subscribe. And like I said, on the comments, post any future topics you want to talk about. It doesn't have to be reef-related. Uh, I mean, we're, I'm still going to be working on the tanks and then just talking about whatever fucking subject and shit. But all right, guys. But that's pretty much it. And like I said, I'll see you guys next time, man. And like, like I said, check it out. Fucking, um, if you don't have a fucking tank, fucking set that shit up or contact me and I'll send you links on what to get. But yeah, I'll give you guys the best advice as I can and shit that actually fucking works. Fuck buying all that bullshit that they make you buy or you see all the motherfuckers use. You don't need none of that shit. But all right, guys, uh, I'll let you guys go. I'm just going to let it run for another like 10, 20 seconds and we're all done. All right. But thank you guys for joining.